The gang's all here. I've been arrested. I don't know why I just put these on. New costume. We got new props for the videos. We got a cop outfit. I need Steven to put this back on because you look perfect when you wore that. We gave Steven the golden goose kicks. Fresh. <laughs> golden goose, like we're putting it on the mat. Because it's a designer brand, but not a lot of people wear it. Rob put me on. <laughs> we're putting y'all on. We put Steven on. They come looking distressed. I see Steven's even gotten a, li a little bit even more distressed. <laughs> Steven comes to me and says, uh, The soles are a little too soft because uh, we put Dr. Scholl's soles <laughs> And um, they feel like a little bit too soft. Too soft. Your Original shoes were too comfortable. comfortable. Yeah. Some people like picky. I'm just no, no. Some people like a firm mattress. Some people yeah. like a more plushy, more comfortable mattress. Yeah. So, Officer Stevens, we're gonna replace these right now. Hopefully, he likes the more firm feel. Yeah. Pause. Super pause. Uh, I think okay. <laughs> these shoes are not that comfortable without the sole in it. But Stevens' wish will be our command because I like Steven and he deserves the best. This doesn't even fit. <laughs> <laughs> you look like a cartoon, Yo, dude. My feet are steamy, boy. And my feet feel like they're like this. But maybe it's because I'm so used to the other soles like that. I don't know. Why do they do it like that? They could break them in. So apparently that's gonna lower. I'm gonna give it like a dead and see how it feels. Okay. And then we'll let you keep those too, and just yeah. whenever you wanna swap them out, bro. Are these so hard? Wrong size. I ordered them online. <laughs> Idiot. What he said. Steven, arrest them. Sir, uh, we'll just run it back real quick. I'll just like walk in, okay? <laughs> I'm hey, too fresh. He has to arrest sir, me. Put your hands behind your back. Just so imagine Steven's actually like tries to be a guy. Yeah, look at he is right now. Go, go, go. Actually, y'all should. Hey, sir. Hey, um, sorry. You're, uh, can I see your driver's registration license, please? Uh, I'm good. Huh? I'm good. Oh. You're, you're fine. Arrest him. Um, um, okay. Yeah, he sorry. needs to be arrested. Of course, we did. Um, did. You're under arrest. Get it? No, like, no, like you actually need him. You're under arrest. I think I'm good. Apply pressure. Get him. He's running away. He's a runaway convict. Don't follow me. Go ahead, cuff him. Tell him if he resists again, he's gonna stay in jail. If you resist again, you're gonna. Well, I don't like. I don't like it. What are we gonna do? Off now. <laughs> So let's talk about your pants. Yeah, what in the hell are these? For the ones that have been watching the vlog channel know that I got these at ThriftCon that Rob let Rhino and I go to. I have never worn them ever. Look at this. Honestly, it's a fashion statement though. I just don't even think these can be worn. Well, you're wearing them. Yeah, I am. You define the odds right now. Just so my legs look huge right now. Part of the vibe, I think. I think you can rock anything you want to rock. That's true. It looks ridiculous, but I've never seen this before, so that's why it's hard to accept. I want to wear these out in public one day. You should. Me, I'm going to start rocking this because it's the new trend. Sweatpants game. Noah's uh, pants remind me of like when somebody goes on Ancestry.com and finds out they're like one 100th Native American. That's what it feels like. You guys cultured. Yeah. They make these in my native land. Y'all yeah. wouldn't understand. You Americans would understand. Oh, I'm foreign. Uh, Ancestry.com. 2% Native American. That's really how people be. What are you? Uh, French and Irish. So white. <laughs> yes. Quarter German. A quarter German, French. A little Turkish. Irish. My last name is very Irish. Where were your parents from? They were born here, but like um, my grandmother. Was what? Well, she was from here to the point. Her grandmother. Her grandmother. But we're, we're the most ethnically diverse YouTubers y'all have ever met. I'm mixed. Rob's mixed. We're all mixed. We're the mixed YouTubers. <gasps> the mixed house. Mixed boys. Mixed boys. The mixed masters. The podcast name in the mix. What? <laughs> Mix loving. Mix and mastered. What's that burning smoke? Steven. What is he doing out there? I know he's not doing nothing bad out here. Hey, Steven, what are you doing out here? Uh, I think the main problem was we could smell something inside. What? Yeah, it's like that powerful. Really? Yeah. I'll put it out. Don't yeah, smoke, cool kids. Do not smoke. Yeah. Careful for you. We're gonna change Steven. Yeah, we're this is the old Steven. We're, we're converting him. He's been here for like a month, but it's okay. You gotta mess up to get better, right? Yeah. Does anyone out there need a checked up? <laughs> Stethoscope, boys. Starts walking around with that on. It's a fashion statement. Also, a health benefit for your peers. Take a deep breath in. Out. You hear anything special? Wait a minute. You have a heart, right? These girls would say I don't. My last girl would say I didn't. Did you hear it? A little bit. Let me try. No, I said it worked. I heard my heart. Oh, because See? we get, wait, I didn't press <laughs> it hard enough. Oh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> doom, 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 doom. Yeah, we lit in this, in this. Can you do mine next? Sure. See you. <laughs> It, that doesn't require. I just put the shirt back on. I thought we had a thing off. He alive as shit. I'm alive. This is a good thing to check if you're alive. So if you guys want to check and see if you're alive, buy one of these. If not, you'll never know if you're really alive or not. You're in. 
Which one? Let me do some. <laughs> <laughs> Get the blood flowing. I just couldn't hear it. I don't want to like be loud because the downstairs people. You good? Well, there's no one downstairs. Oh, he's not? No. Watch this. That didn't work. There we go. He's alive now. Oh, I, didn't breathe like out. I didn't want to breathe in your spot. face. Yeah, you're alive now. That's okay. what you gotta do to be alive. Cool. <laughs> so sorry. Yeah. Dude, I was so loud. <laughs> this is usually what I do before I get a tat. You draw Just it on. Just kinda draw it on myself to see how it'll look. Yeah. I'm like trying to fill up all this whole arm, so I'm, I'm about to schedule it all. And uh, Cause I'm like, now or never. Hey. I'm gonna get tattoos, why not get them right now? Steven. Oh shit. Wait, why is Steven good? Okay. I have my balls a little bit heavier. Your what? Like Your what? It's also black, so it's hard to see. I can't. It's black red. balls? No, yeah, but like ours is red, so it's a lot more noise. Oh, red okay. balls. Yeah. It... Be one with the ball. <laughs> yeah, we have no hope here. A little fake right hand. Oh. Steven's not awkward. He might hurt you. Sorry, too much. No, you're good. Oops. Rob, oh. Oh, no. Oh. Oh. The angle. Oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, I was joking at first with that actually. <laughs> Second time. Not as aggressive this time. Did you adjust the sentence? I think I did, because I changed the intensity and put it lower. Yeah, every time I use it, I'm like, why isn't it? Yeah. Just so we can get the best experience ever. Like Relaxing now. Maybe we'll leave him in here. The hands, <laughs> ah, the hands. <laughs> Dude, it feels so good. So I was thinking we could just work something out. I could just take this with me. What if we hack the system? Hear me out. We hack the, the motherboard and we use this as a torture machine. We invite guests over and we crush them to death. I'm just kidding, what? Oh, uh, dude. So long. <laughs> so, what brings you here? Uh, I actually had a hanging out. Same. Oh uh, yeah, how long have you been out here for? About a year now. Wait, actually? Yeah. So how do you feel? So good, dude. Would you recommend people to buy this? Uh -huh. oh. What do you have to say to all the people that are thinking about buying one of these? He's in pure bliss right now. Oh, stop. this is so good. Ooh, the vibrating. Uh, I don't know if the noises are necessary. But... <laughs> nope. Yo, guess where we're at? Ikea? Nah, we're at Red Maple. <laughs> I was eating my food, and then the whole Red Maple workers just came out and just serenaded me with a happy birthday and gave me a whole free stack of pancakes. They were like, happy birthday. Last time I checked, my birthday was like six No, but see, they were like, happy belated birthday. They did, they did. So yeah, they just blessed me with this whole free breakfast pancakes. What did they say this was? I don't know, it's a new thing on the menu though. They should have told me that before I started eating all my other food. But hey, this is why Red Maple is the best, and you guys definitely need to come here. Whew. I'm about to take a bite of that. Let's take a bite of this. So I'm about to eat this delicious pancake, and then I looked over. My guy over here has got the strawberry part. Ooh, you know, you know, there we go. And I got mine on too today. What are the other? I swear to God, I didn't tell him. What's your name, man? Oh, nice Alex. to meet you. How'd you find Red Maple? You guys. I watched the vlogs. Yeah. Was this your first time here? Yeah, my first well, what time. What did you think? Dude, it's good. What did you get? I got the the chicken sandwich. So I saw you got it last time. Yep, yep. You got it right there. Hell yeah. See, so you guys, people are actually pulling up, and I appreciate it. And we're here. And we're here. Rob's here today too. I'm here today too, guys. I got the uh, poke bowl. Very delicious. My be my new go-to here, but uh, this is why I like this place because it's very versatile. It has a lot of different options. You have American, burgers, sandwich, breakfast burritos, delicious pancakes, poke, come on. And the drink, the lemonade, we added the strawberries to the thing, so it's like a, it's a new wave. The downside to all of that is, today I was telling Noah that I might start a keto diet just to try it for a month or whatever and see what it does to me, what type of effects it'll take on my body, how it'll affect my energy levels, and I'm just trying to constantly grow and improve myself, so I was like, like, why not try it? But seeing all this delicious food makes me kind of um, reconsider it. So if any of you do keto, comment down below what are some good like keto diets or foods that I can eat because we're on a fitness journey. And what'd you do to your hand today? Oh my gosh, look Ooh. at that. Oh, bruh. If you're eating, I'm sorry. It's not that bad, but two months since we boxed, but we're back at it. We're trying to do it every day, run, workout, back on the routine. And nutrition. Nutrition, back on track, uploads back on track. We're trying to just get back on track. So basically today, like my knuckles aren't strong anymore so the rap was like pushing it back and sand preparing it down but uh it's a battle scar yep. that's what happens when you're like tough and you're like rugged and you're just like a badass like you get stuff like this it's like actually nothing to me so i'm used to it and uh, there's probably gonna be a lot more things that happen but uh when you're tough like me it's not really a big issue yeah, so. tough boy tough boy